Welcome, YouTube as YouTube to Hellblade, Senua's Sacrifice. I am burning ore. Let's go straight back into the center, shall we? Uh, I have a bit of a sore shoulder, so I apologize if uh, I'm like, I keep doing this. Because I'm like trying to keep my shoulder in line, so it's not being a dick. I think I uh, I slept on it wrong last night. Well, Dom Torn in the... Uh, in the comment in the in the stream so I had a theory that we're hella that we're hella no well that we're actually hella oh Gate. It's opening. they have a cave troll Oh, what the fuck? Holy shit! Okay, we're not hello. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um. What are you doing? You're showing weakness. You're not a warrior. You're a disgrace. The gods will punish you for this. Pick up the sword. Pick it up. Fight the darkness. Fight it. Oh my goodness. I'm not scared. I'm a fucking warrior. I've killed three gods. Get up and fight. Whoa. My sword's broken. Well, that was my heart, and it's gone. <laughs> Can you read? reaching deep inside of her. Stormy seas and lost souls. She's dreamt of this before. They say dreams are visions of our memories, thoughts, and fears, as seen by our inner eye. But what if each one of us is always dreaming, even when awake, and we only see what our inner eye creates for us? Is this what hell is? world shaped by Senua's nightmares. <laughs> Sometimes completely wrong. that's why people feared seeing the world through her eyes. Because if you believe that Senua's reality is twisted, you must accept that yours might be too. You failed the gods. You're pathetic. Rotten. Cursed. What were you thinking? Did you really think you could win? How stupid can you be? Everyone hates her. She's a girl. Look at you. A warrior. Worthless. Weak. Pathetic. Go on. Feel sorry for yourself. Because there's no one left to do that for you. Take it. If you're too much of a coward to fight, then end the suffering. Don't do it, Senua. Broken and lost. Just do like it. your sword. Do it. Come on. There. <laughs> oh, she's healing herself. That's what I'm talking about, girl. Caught right on the wound. Don't let Shadow win. Why go on when you give everything and face that Thank you, which Hallway. torments you, only to find that it is worse than you could have imagined? Why go on? Is it really so weak to ask this? Or are we just so afraid of the honest answer that we do not dare pose the question? It's, te it's, a, it's a medical technique. Sometimes the answer lies in a memory. Caught rising. A feeling. A song. It's not real. God, the animation in this is so good. It's 
So I'm talking to these voices are me, right? You don't try and kill yourself by. She put the flat of the blade on her cut. That's not how you want to kill yourself. <laughs> you know. Oh, well, I'm not sure. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't know because I don't know anything about this game. So I've, for my uh, yeah, let's have a look at her face, right? Look, look, she's she, yeah, she's cauterized that. Yeah, she knew what she was doing. Her hand clipping through her chest though is a bit weird. But I mean, the game looks beautiful, so I'm not gonna give too much shit. <laughs> Tom Twan. Yeah, I think everybody's tried that. You just you just fall unconscious. Uh, but apparently we um Vice Black seems to think we'll get we'll get this finished tonight, so. I like the fact she's got a mirror, the mirror on it. Okay, so we can't go over that rock. We have to go over this. <laughs> so these voices are me talking to me, I imagine. Like my depression, my chronic depression just getting to me. Before she first met him, she was not in a good place. Just a teenager, but not like the others. Barely functioning, she rarely left the house. Her father, Zinbel, made sure of that. Only occasionally She's running did she venture enough. out on her own, collecting firewood and herbs, errands out in the Orkney plains. That was her world. Look how pretty this is. Like this one. Barren. And lonely. Yeah. I'm getting strung on my, uh... Oh. It's already disappeared. Nothing lives here, not even you. Are we in hell right now, I wonder? You think you can see this it? hell. Where? She remembers the first time she saw him. I can't see any tree. I think I missed something. He moved as if dancing. And the world danced with him. The groom lifted. For the first time in years, she felt a ray of hope. Looks more like Hell Jer New Jersey. Yeah. Mate, this music. I'm loving this. I love this kind of music. Just, hang on, just for a moment. I know, I just want to take ourselves out of the game. I appreciate that lighting on that rock there. Look at that. I know that's like really weird to point out, but I just, you know, on the left there. It just looks so good. The North. Hero. His name is Sigmund. His father's hall was built around a great tree, and one day Odin comes and thrusts a sword into the tree, a gift to whomever can release it. Many try, but the sword only comes out at Sigmund's touch. His brother in law, King Sigir, wants it, but Sigmund refuses him. So King Sigir plots revenge. He invites Sigmund and his brothers to a feast. But when they arrive, they are met with an army, not a warm welcome. King Sigir captures Sigmund and his brothers, steals his coveted sword, and readies them for execution.
that was a cave over there. Tis not. Excuse me. Tis but a fake cave. Watching from afar, she mimicked him. Perfecting her own secret dance. Wishing that nice. fleeting moments of light would stretch see him. out to last forever. It's a trick. It's an illusion. It's not real. It's, it's the tree. You want to believe it. Oh, fuck. You're deluded. What is she following? You can't even fight. It's just deception. How does he so effortlessly court the world and bliss? If only she could do the same. See the world through eyes anew. And dance with it. Just like he does. What's your name? Senua. Mm -hmm. I haven't seen you before. I'm not... I don't leave home much. Oh. Zeno's daughter. I have to go. Wait! <laughs> Awfully modern accents. Who's you to fight like that? No one. <laughs> no one? Well... I... I watched you. And... You... Learned all of that from watching me. <laughs> you should become a warrior, you know. Me? I'm Dillian. I'm here for the warrior trials. Just come and watch. And bring your sword. You can't put it into words. That moment when you look into the eyes of the one who's supposed to reassure you. Make you feel safe. It only takes an instant. Well, that's a hanging tree. Swallows you before you have a chance to make sense of it. And darkness becomes a part of who you are. But her world changed the day the Northmen took him from her. This so is no definitely inside her. Back to how things were. That Oops, there's sorry. nothing to go back to at all. Stay still, stay quiet, hide, don't tell her. Their gods can see into your mind. They will use this power to destroy you. They won't stop me. I can still feel him. Whatever's left of him, they will never let him go. I'm not gonna let him rot here! You're the one rotting here. Leave me alone. You will die here. No! And all your suffering will have been for nothing! Shut up! This is really well, like, choreographed. Like, the camera work is so good. Dillion? Is that you? I will find you, my friend. I promise. You want to believe it? Is, is he there? not real? Is he there? You're alone in these mountains. Is that Delia? Nothing lives here. These mountains are my mind. You won't survive. What's this? You met him by the tree. She met me by the tree. Maybe it's a sign. The tree. What's he trying to tell you? Nope. Oh, okay. He's waiting for you by the tree. There's a lot of dead people in that tree. Uh. <laughs> Okay, I have a feeling that these are going to be important. <laughs> oh, wait, what? Have we ever shot something? Uh, okay, I think I can climb up here, maybe? No? Uh, that's where I can drop off, okay. But drop off!
Mate, I just want to get to the fucking tree. Why you gotta make this hard? <laughs> Why you gotta make this weird, you know? You don't have to make this weird, man. But you can climb up there easy. Death for Sigmund and his brothers seems certain. But the king's wife is Sigmund's sister, and she begs for mercy and implores the king to chain them up instead. He agrees. Not for mercy, though, but because he plans an even more cruel and lingering death. Chained to a tree in the forest that night, a she wolf comes and devours one of Sigmund's brothers. She returns, ravenous, night after night. Until only Sigmund is left. Oh. The next day, Sigmund's sister sends a servant with honey to smear on Sigmund's face. But to what end? Well, that night, when the she wolf appears again, you're gonna stop, are you? You'll never guess what happens. What fucking happened there, mate? Don't you fucking tell me, are you, you little shit? Ah. Uh. Okay, fine. Fine. Hopefully this will give me... Are you... Yes. As the she-wolf licks the sweet honey from Sigmund's face, he bites the wolf's tongue. The she-wolf pulls away, but Sigmund holds on. The chains break, and he is free. After his escape, Sigmund lives like us, hidden in the forest. His enemy, King Sigir, believing him dead, as his sister, has revenge. And for vengeance to succeed, even the great Sigmund needs help. So she sends her sons to him. But their blood is weak and corrupted, and they're put to death by Sigmund. So his sister hatches a new plan, one that is cold of heart and pure of blood. Okay. <clears throat> Is there another one of these lovely stories? <clears throat> Seem pretty great. I guess not. Um, what? What is this? Oh, it's a sword. Oh boy. Level up. Master sword, here we come. Alright, grudge girl. Calm down. Oh, oh. Knew it. What's happening? Senua, imagine a sword that can slay gods. <laughs> its name is Gramr. Gramr. It was forged by the god of all Northmen, Odin, and gifted to Sigmund, a great warrior. I need this sword. It's important. Can you help me? The sword appears whole, but it is an illusion. It shattered into shards long ago. It is said a great warrior can reforge Grammar by answering the trials of Odin, one for each shard. That's what these. The roots of the tree of death will take you to new lands where you will face the trials. Yeah, I got it. Grammar. <laughs> the great sword grammar dwarves to make a sword that would never fail and never rust and that would slice through iron and stone and bring victory to its bearer but the angry dwarves cursed it 
It would be the death of a man every time it was drawn. And it would be the death of the king. Let me tell you about the sword Tyrving. There's another sword. Yes. I don't recognize this place. Where are we? Where is she? It feels wrong. Where are we now? Huh? Huh? So strange that we go to such lengths to bury death. Something so very ordinary, inevitable. It's as if we conspire to hide death because we have no answer for it. But when it comes and it forces itself onto our friends or loved ones, then comes the reckoning. No one, we're completely fine, love. Let's follow the wall. Okay, we're good. Dillian, I'm here. I'm here for the trials. Why would Where Dillian be here, me? Senua? Why would he be here? There he is. There he is. Dillian, there he is. Finally. You found him. What's wrong? What happened? Can you hear me? Did you let him go again? Just wait there. I'll find you. Actually, let him. He's not there, Senua. Jesus. Oh man. Find him, get him. Oh sweet. How could you lose him? How could you lose him? How could she find him? Um Do I have to focus on something? Okay, maybe not. <laughs> I'll find him. I think I think there was no question of that. All right, we're gonna follow the, the right wall. Oh. What was that? Did you hear that? Nothing. Was that voices? I didn't hear anything. Just shut up, voices in my head. Oh, you'll be all right. I got the torch. I'll be fine. Find another way. It's not working. You have to use your mind. Where can you go? You're failing. Find a think. Way. Think. 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 Focus. Think. Use your mind. Thank you. Thank you for this great advice, guys. <laughs> Senua, you remind me of a story that the Northmen tell about a young woman warrior. You stop that talk right now, hallway. You stop that talk right now. Of a berserker born after he was killed. <laughs> What if the She's a wild, left wall is a right wall? Child who teaches herself to fight with weapons. When she learns where her father is buried, her only desire is to reclaim the treasure buried with him, but above all, the sword, Tyrvin. Okay, we're following the left wall now. What if the... What if the... The the right wall is the left wall. Okay, we've been here. You don't recognize it. Don't doubt yourself, you'll never find it. She doesn't recognize it. Yes, you do. You we haven't she been doesn't. here. Listen for his voice, listen. Dillian. Where listen are you? Listen for his voice, Dillian. Does everything look the same? Looks the same. Clues are different. Okay. The clues are The clues are where I haven't lit before. It's not here. We told you. You know, because every passage that I'm not in is not lit as fuck. You know what I'm saying? Okay, he's down here because the voices. I'm listening to the voices in my head and the voices down this imaginary tunnel. I'm gonna be fine. Everything's gonna be fine. <laughs> Strangely. How do we get 
get in there? Voice. How did we get it's in not there? Dying. We came all this way, Senua. We came all this way, Senua. God, it sounds like a cow. I don't like cows. Game. I don't like cows, okay? <clears throat> oh, that is lovely. Um, sure. Oh, this thing's in, in uh, vibrating now. That's that's fun. What is this then, huh? What are we walking into here? Let's just open the door, shall we? I'm sure nothing, nothing is going to hurt me. Oh, you bloody ding dong. I'm leaving. Now that's a stiff Sorry. upper lip if ever I've seen I think one. It will be good for me. It's the darkness. It's speaking through no, you. No, Dad, it's me. I think I can beat it. In my own way. I can see the darkness in your eyes, child. I met a boy. Boy. No. He said he could help me. It's a trick. He said it could be normal. Normal? Yes. No boy is going to save you. No one can. When they see the rot growing no. inside you, no. they will turn their back on you. The gods can only fix you through my hand. You're going nowhere. No. You will not defy the gods. Wow. Come, child. Take my hand. Come. Send one. No. I am leaving. You cannot escape the darkness. Your curse will make everyone suffer. You will have blood on your hands! Okay, so that was the first shard. I'm sure the next three, four, how many there are, are going to be absolutely peachy. It's going to be uh, ponies and uh, rainbows and pink flowers and... Can I do another one? Do you think I am a pussy? Wait, which way do I go, guys? Got to go around again, haven't I? Yeah. Balls. Sure, I have. Look, look. I'm not even. I'm not even holding the left side of myself anymore. I am absolutely fine. You got a friend in me voices in my head. I am the most reliable Senua there ever was. But before we go into this shard, we're going to stop this episode. Episode 6, I want to say this was? I think? <laughs> I think this is episode 6, I think. Uh, yeah, thank, yeah, YouTube, thanks for joining me for uh, Hellblade Center of Sacrifice. Uh, yeah, just give me comments, you know, if you uh, like or dislike, you know, uh, give me positive and negative comments. I uh, love them all. Uh, and if you enjoyed it, you know, just give it a little share. Uh, and I'll see you in the next episode. Owl is out. Bye! Mm -hmm.